Excuse me, sir. What is a handsome man like you doing waiting in line? I need an adult. I need an adult. <laughs> Warren Fredericks, Quahog Beautiful People's Club. Come on in front. But but all, all those people were in front of me. You haven't been beautiful very long, have you? Gorgeous guys like us don't have to wait in line. Haven't you noticed? People will do anything for a beautiful person. Yeah. You know, come to think of it. Hi. I'm on a scavenger hunt, and I need a human foot. Well, as a rule, I would say no, but okay, come in. So, uh, so this is what? This is for like a school project? Ah! 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 Raul, please take this handsome gentleman's bags to his car. Thank you. Hey, when you're beautiful, doors magically open for you. Actually, it opened because you stepped on that black rubber square. Of course, if that wasn't there, it would have opened anyway because you're beautiful. Wow. Hey, there's a lot of good-looking people here. Of course. This is the Quahog Beautiful People's Club, and you're our newest member. Here's your introductory basket. It's got some scented lotions, Ferrari sunglasses, and, of course, some pills to make your bowel movements smell like bakery-fresh cinnamon rolls. Oh, what happened? Orson fall down? Shut up! Just... Stop. I... I don't want to hit it! Well, serves you right. You spent all that time trying to make Chris jealous, and now you have an eating disorder. Just help me up! Well, you know, I would, but my doctor advised me against heavy lifting. Who? Oh, ha de ha ha What... what the... the devil are you doing? Stop it! Stop it! I'm getting dizzy! Ah! Boss! Peter, did you paste a new picture of yourself on our wedding portrait? Yeah, I think it looks better. You pasted it over me. Yeah, I think it looks better. <sighs> have you lost your mind? Well, somebody's jealous. Peter, have you forgotten about Chris? He needs you to help him exercise. Yeah, he finally figured out how to catch the Twinkie. Ha <laughs> ha! I'm turning you into poo. Well, I'm going down to the beautiful people's club. Guess I can take him with me. Hell, seeing us all in one place might give him something to shoot for. The Beautiful People's Club? How come I never heard of that? Lois, I, I can't say anymore. I, I'm probably already in trouble for mentioning it to a, uh... Well, we, we call you normies. Okay, bye. Are you gonna take that? Lois! What? Oh, Brian, I was, uh, I was seeing if the, uh, driveway... That wasn't even a sentence. You were ogling, Peter, like a horny schoolgirl. Oh, I can't help it. I know, I know. He's become a superficial, egomaniacal jerk, but I've never been more attracted to him. Oh, does that make me a bad person? Yes. Yes, it does make you a bad person. Peter, good to see you. Come with me. I've got a lot of tall, statuesque people I want you to meet. What's that? Oh, that's my son, Chris. He can't come in. <laughs> He's fat. Well, let me tell you something, buddy. If my son can't come in, then I'll just come in. See you at home. But, Dad... Trust me, Chris. Sometimes it's better not to fit in. You're all stupid. See, they're gonna be looking for army guys. <laughs> 